Welcome to the tribe. We got some Andrew Schultz today. I love me some comedy, so I'm ready to dive in. Apparently in this video, an Asian animal rights activist just wasn't ready. A lot of people in life that just aren't ready. So let's dive in and uh, let's see what happens in this one. I don't want to talk about that. What, do you really like animals, miss? Yes, do. You do? Which ones is, are your favorite? Every animal? That's sweet. Every single animal. They all have life. They all have life. You're right. 100% right about that. They don't all need to. I feel like you haven't experienced enough life or death situations with animals. You know what I mean? Do you think an animal cares about your life? You think a polar bear is going, you know what? She's probably got backgammon on Tuesday. Maybe I won't either. I'm just gonna sit here with this Coca-Cola and sip it with my nephews. But I understand, you like animals because, you know, you live in the first world and it's boring and we gotta care about shit. I get it, I'm with you. Say again? Would you see me? I'm technically from I, I almost thought you said, do you see me? I'm an animal. And I was... <laughs> I was about to be like, whoa. Because <laughs> you are Asian, right? So that would make you panda a little bit, right? No. <laughs> no. You're third world, but you're third world, but you're from America, right? You're born and raised here? No. Where were you born? Philippines. Philippines. When did you come here? Uh, when I was like eight years old. Oh, so you had some real shit? Yeah, I had some real shit. And in the Philippines, are there any animals that they eat that we don't eat here? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Andrew Schultz is different. I love this man. I love this man because he will dance on the topics that, <laughs> that people don't like to dance on, and I think it's hilarious. I just told my English friend that we're not going to win this. You're not going to win this. But it's, it's not about win or lose. It's not about win or lose. It's just about understanding shit. In the Philippines, they eat dogs because they don't care as much about dogs, right? Because they don't have Chipotle. They don't have Chipotle, they got Chihuahua. Because they get too hungry. She's not going to win this one. Nice and warm. <laughs> With rice. I love some rice out there, huh? <laughs> That's all I'm saying. We're very lucky that we get to care about that we get to care about these. What part of the Philippines were you from? Cebu. Cebu. Now is that a wealthy region or is that a poor region? <clears throat> It's probably poor, right? <laughs> I'm just guessing. City. It's because a, we put the city next to it, then right. that means that it's somewhat... We don't gotta go into it. So... <laughs> it's a poor region. <laughs> where there's probably things there, right? That they'd be so lucky and grateful to have that we just take for granted right here. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Like drinking water right there, it might not be the best. And maybe there's some people out there that don't even have fresh drinking water, you know? And tonight, you're gonna go home and take a shit into clean water. <laughs> That's why I hate the sob story. I care about my people back home. <laughs> <laughs> we have to look out of people for third world country. <laughs> 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 
Andrew Schultz is the man. I, I, I love his comedy. And again, I love it because he, he will talk about stuff that people are scared to talk about. But as I said in a previous video we did with Andrew Schultz, which should drop before this one, where he talked about a black man and his white son, which was absolutely hilarious. These are hot topics that it's, it's, it's good to make funny. It's good to laugh about. It's good to joke about. Instead of always making it these tiptoe subjects of, oh, wait, you can't because black people will be offended or oh, Asian people will be offended. Or if there's no hatred behind it, it's fair game. Like, that's the whole point of comedy. So... I love this stuff. As far as the animal rights thing, it's very interesting, right? Like we 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 push for animal rights and, and animals to not be killed and, and slaughtered and, and so on and so forth. And there's certain ways which is horrible where they just literally raise an animal just to be slaughtered and it sits in like a little pen and it never leaves it and, and stuff like that is horrible. I'm not going to say that it's not regardless of the fact that I eat meat. It, it's, it's horrible and I'm not going to say that it's not. But it's just interesting that we push so hard for animal life but yet, half the, I feel like half the people that push for animal life, they see a spider in their house or something, they killing that motherfucker, right? This whole, well, it, the animals have life. Well, so do the bugs. <laughs> so do a lot of, you know what I'm saying? Like, technically, plants are alive to an extent, right? But we just chop those bitches up and, and cook them. And, I, you know, I'm just saying, like, we don't know what hurts. What does, I just, just, you know, just things to think about. But anyways, shout out to Andrew Schultz. Let me know what else you guys want to see down below. This was a fun one. I'll catch you next video.